Hello guys, good morning. Welcome to Bin's Black. And today we have uh, synchronizing again. And this is uh, the new project that we have today. And uh, we done it already uh, yesterday. I just want you to uh, to uh, simulate this uh, this uh, kind of project that we have. This one is uh, half the totalizing. This is uh, two pieces, 1,250 kVA uh, synchronizing. We have uh, the ETS itself and the control to control module and also we have here the two load system so i will simulate that to you so you can see also how it will work what is uh, the functionality for this one um first thing <coughs> we're going to uh, direct start in auto mode and everything i will uh, <coughs> uh, simulate the automations and the functionality uh, for this uh, project so let's go outside so we can start with this one because they are in hurry uh, because uh, today also is the delivery for this uh, uh, generator okay by installing mechanical interlock you must remove first the electrical interlock which is the under voltage so we need to remove first the uh, under voltage yeah. uh, solenoid in so order to uh, work with this uh, yeah. mechanical. So you can test because you'll know that we, if there's no power, no, you cannot, uh -huh. so you cannot activate open it. or energize your breaker. So we will uh, return also. But similarly, if our Mechanical is mechanical interlock is installed properly or correctly, maybe mm -hmm. not. So, first thing we're going to energize that one, right? Charge, yes. Manually, this is manually. Uh, manually energize. And then after that, we are also uh, so charge that one. And so, first breaker. Close no? the breaker, that one. Now it is working, it is working now. Then right. we are going to when on or on up. So, so it is not uh, working. You cannot hold the other side. It is push the yes. interlock, interlock, which is interlock. this one. This, this is the mechanical side. So this is the one. Uh, we make the interlocking. Now uh, if so. I... It's uh, also the same, no? Mm. From that side. So you can add. And then you off, 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 and this then this one is on. You can on, yeah. So, so that is the like this one to if it will uh, on, we can charge it, but we cannot energize or uh, close, close the breaker because we have already the interlock in it, yeah. So I mean, to say we put it correctly, yes, that is correct. So it is working uh, properly, and after that, you have going to uh, return return the solenoid, right. For the electrical man? Yeah. <laughs> so you can proceed for the, the electrical. Also. Electrical and the synchronizing. Yeah. So as you can see, here is our generator number two and our generator number one. This is already fully connected. And it is also fully connected. And here is the uh, back view of your our uh, totalizing and our ETS. So, so over here, I will show you. This is the control panel for our synchronizing. This is the generator number one and button generator number three. So this is the wiring inside, as you can see. It is fully uh, connected. So this is deep uh, sea 86 inch, and here is our control number two, and we want it already. So now uh, this side is the. Uh, breaker for our generator side and this is the breaker for our commercial side 
So this is the uh, DSE 35 for the ATS control and this is our uh, load side for uh, two load side. So this is outgoing one and this is outgoing two. So for now, we're going to assemble it for the two direct output so we can see uh, how we're going to assemble this. So now uh, we're going to uh, put the power supply for the commercial. So it will supposedly the breaker will uh, the breaker will on uh, automatically. So now I will just put the manual. Check if this one is. So as you can see, the breaker is closed from our S1 so that is S1 is our commercial side so now it is closed and we have power supply for this one so now I will put all two of these things so we will wait when uh, we command the generator to start and this one will sync the two first and then automatically he will close the breaker and after that this one sinks automatically then it will automatically also put the jeans inside of our breaker because I will off uh, the commercial side in order to functions our automations. Okay, so I just close this one and So okay guys, now we're going to simulate this one. I will put auto to our ETS. This is uh, the Deep C ETS 35. Then I will put also auto for this two generator. Now once it is running, it will sync first before he will give the power to the our generator side. So now I will uh, off our means so it will command the generator to start. This is temporarily uh, the conditions for our means so I will just off this one. So meaning there is no commercial power.
so uh, that is the simulation for that one so you see it is working fine and uh, it is synchronizing uh, correctly it will give to the power supply to the uh, generator and when the mains is come generator is cooled down and will goes back to the main supply so that's it so this is uh, uh, our update today so see you again in my next vlog